Hello. Why you should be terrified of North Korea's princess? For his entire time as a supreme leader of North Korea, for he, his really, he really got that penguin walk though. Time. His hairline's f***ed up. Dude, Kim Jong-un has a better hairline than me. My hairline's f***ed. Was Jake missing. Paul versus Putin. Facts. Boxing match, it's over. By studying satellite images, North Korean state-run media, North Korean military parades, and tracking flights in and out of the country, intelligence analysts were able to determine- <laughs> What is this close-up? ...determined that Kim Jong-un was indeed in hiding. Yeah, everybody remember when everyone thought that Kim Jong-un died? And it was like a staged thing. Like, it was for like two weeks. Everyone was like, Kim Jong-un had a heart attack or some shit. And then everyone that was, like, against him came out against him, and then they executed all those people, and then Putin came back fine. I was like, that's some f***ing movie that. shit! Was the most dangerous much. leader of the East ill, or maybe up. even dead? And then suddenly, someone emerges in his footsteps to watch the throne. A woman named Kim Yo Jong, Kim Jong Un's sister. She's very well educated, involved in politics, and took over many of Kim's duties while he was missing. She will most likely be way more ruthless than her brother ever was. Oh no. If her past is anything to go by. Nah, this shit's making me- This shit's giving me goosebumps, bro. This is like some weird shit. It's li- Dude, every, every story about North Korea is like out of a fucking movie, bro. Everything just seems so unreal. How they killed like the fucking uncles of Kim Jong-un and shit. How he acted like he died and then they executed everybody that came out. Oh, dude, it's fucking weird. I saw this on TikTok the other day. So off topic. Why is there West Virginia and Virginia? There's North Carolina and South Carolina. Why isn't there West Virginia and East Virginia? Where's East? Bitch, what? Anyways. Kim Jong-un has at least four brothers and sisters. But most of them- Hold up, let me pause this. Never, never seen this shit before. Wait, how many wives did this motherfucker have? Three? I need a bunch of kids. Holy shit. Kim Jong-un has a brother. Kim Jong-chol. Rejected as heir by Kim jong Two. Wow. That motherfucker looks like he plays Clash of Clans. Nah, this is a gamer. That's him. This is a gamer. This is a gamer. That's a gamer. G fucking, those are probably blue light glasses. Yeah, he's definitely a gamer. For sure, no doubt. His oldest half-brother, who was up. first in line to take over the country. Until he got caught trying to sneak into Tokyo Disneyland with a fake passport, to which he got exiled by his dad, and eventually assassinated- WHAT?! He got assassinated for sneaking into Disney? No, I thought he just got assassinated. They tricked girls into thinking they were on, like, a prank television show, and they just fucking, like, shoved his face full of, like, what they thought was whipped cream. Wasn't whipped cream. Then there's Kim So Song. His older half sister, who was very active in politics and said to be her dad's favorite. Unfortunately, it wasn't a great time for women in North Korea when her father died, so she got overlooked because of her gender. The next best option would be Kim Jong Un's other brother, Kim Jong Chol, except he's more interested in guitars, Eric, and becoming the North Korean Hugh Hefner than taking on the moral responsibility. What did I say? He looks like a gamer. Of Kim Jong Un's younger sister, Kim Yo Jong. Kim's sister was lucky enough to be sent to a prestigious Swiss school to get a first-class education. Unfortunately, the majority of us aren't as lucky as Kim's sister. But thanks to the internet, we can learn practically anything a prestigious- I swear to God, if this is a fucking ad, I can predict them. I can predict them. Fucking, oh my God, I know the lead up. Oh, well, luckily we can learn things on the internet. Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, what do you, what do you, oh, really? Her dad sent her and Kim Jong-un to school in Switzerland. She enrolled under the fake name Pak Mi Huang. Their mother was a concubine, not an official wife. So he sent them away to protect them from the North Korean elites. And of course, to protect his reputation as a moral and divine supreme Joe leader. And, and that's why they went to study in Switzerland for that reason. So the two- Dude, that's why Kim Jong-un likes basketball. I watched a whole documentary on that. Like, when he was in Switzerland, Kim Jong-un was like- That's why, like, he was into ski lifts and he had friends that play basketball. That's why he likes the NBA and all that other shit. Because, like, he learned all that there. When Kim Yo Jong finished school, instead of leaning into more of modern society and the West, she chose to go back to Pyongyang and join the Kim Il Sung University. She studied a special computer science course that gave her a degree in just six months. No one really knew or cared about who she was. She never appeared on TV. Now you know when they got their e you, you know when they got their hair slicked back behind their ears that they're that they're time. they're fucking she made her like, psychos. You know what I mean? When they when they slick it back behind their ears. When her brother got sick just a few months later, she easily took over some of his duties. 
Around that time, she was also a deputy director at the Propaganda and Agitation Department, which is basically in charge of making the Kim family look like gods. She Do you also think they have like regular conversations, like Kim Jong Un and his sister. Do you think they have like regular conversations? How was your day? The weather's really like like taught like do you think yeah no I think they do. I would love to be I would love to see that type of conversation just like a regular conversation between the brother and the sister. Yo like I'm just saying y'all like that that as a picture. Like a a big portrait. Does North Korea have Adidas or do they have their own version of brands? Like what's the big brand? Um they get a lot of stuff over the border from China like illegally. I watch documentaries on like their street markets in North Korea. Um, but I would assume they just have base stuff. I, I, I don't think they would get anything imported. Most things that when you come through the country, anything Americanized or American brands get stripped from their, uh, names. Came his right-hand woman, as close as you can get to the Supreme Leader. What's even more interesting is that over the years, up, many analysts have come to suspect that she's the real brains behind the regime. Her brother just has to put on a smile and do as she says. Ever since 2014, she's in the background of almost every public appearance her brother makes. Kim Yo Jong might be the one pulling the strings behind the Hermit Kingdom. Oh, that's some creepy shit, bro. What if she's actually controlling the country and he's not? And he just wants to play basketball or some shit. In 2017, she became the second woman ever to be promoted to North Korea's Politburo, their inner political circle. She also married the son of the nominal head of states. The I was she married this motherfucker? guy in charge of the army and the he is old as fuck the kim family is genetically fat but she's extremely thin pale and always looks a little bit ill her complexion and behavior brought south korean doctors to suggest she's probably on meth <laughs> <laughs> bro that was a curveball that was a fucking that was a fucking curveball what so when she visited South Korea around 2018, the She's hitting a bump of that good old Walter White crystal blue. Oh! In South Korea, we're saying her look, her complexion shows like she was using a lot of crystal meth drug. I don't think she's on. I don't think she's on crystal meth. I, I'm going to say that. I feel like it would be more noticeable if she was on meth. North Korea produces and exports huge amounts of drugs like crystal meth to keep the money. What? Is, is Kim Jong-un's sister on crystal meth? No shot. Their coffers. So her being addicted to the stuff doesn't seem so far-fetched. At the time, she said she looked sick because she was pregnant, but her looks haven't changed ever since. And if having a sober dictator in North Korea is terrifying, just imagine what a dictator hopped up on meth would be like. Back to her visit. Probably pretty, pretty interesting. After she got no, I don't do fucking meth. Okay, now if you're gonna say I'm pale, it's because I'm fucking German. I'm tan in the summer. I'm not on meth. Look at my teeth and my fucking eyes. I'm not on meth. Are you fucking kidding me? I- what? South Korean activists started sending massive amounts of anti-Kim propaganda over the border using balloons. She immediately released a statement calling South Korea's president insane for allowing them to do that. She threatened to destroy the inter-Korean liaison office that was supposed to keep the communication between the two sides open, and a day later, the building was blown up. <laughs> Apparently, when Kim Yo-jong orders something, North Korea obeys. She's becoming even more aggressive than her brother. What if she's actually on meth? Before she could take the throne, Kim Jong-un re-emerges. He had lost a lot of weight, probably- that is not a picture. If <laughs> what the fuck is that? To get them to respect and fear her, she has no choice but to be as ruthless as possible. At least until the Sonnies gets older enough, Kim Yo Jong gonna act as a supreme leader. So a lot of people say because she's young, Western educated, and woman, she must be a better leader. Her record doesn't show. Us that. She I'm not trying to be that guy, but she probably would be a better leader. Like, I don't want her to lead because, like, yeah, but she probably would be. A Based off this video alone, if I'm just guessing off of that, yeah, she would probably be a better leader. She even threatened Joe Biden recently, what? saying if America wants to sleep in peace for the coming four years, it had better refrain from causing a stink at its first step. 
That doesn't make any fucking sense. What the fuck does that mean? It sounds like someone on meth. No, it sounds like a translation. The idea of a diehard dictator on meth was something to prove. In charge of the- Bro, okay, no one has factual evidence that she's on meth. He's just- He's claiming that she's on meth. Like, uh, uh, a dictator on math. Like, what? We don't know. Nobody cares. I'm gonna end the video. I'm gonna end the video.